come here, come, come. Come prep with me for back to school. So I live in America and I go to school there, but I came back to Nigeria for the break and for other things too. And yeah, that's just saying that I had no one so much fun. I was a little too comfortable because school literally starts in five days and I'm still here in Nigeria. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah i'm gonna be getting my hair done today my nails my toes you know and all that good stuff today and yeah so i'm like why not just come with me i go back to america in two days and baby i'm not trying to talk about that i am not trying to talk i don't know if i'm ready so let's talk about my hair okay let's go get my hair done If I wrote you a symphony Just to say how much you mean to me What would you do? If I told you you were beautiful Would you date me on the regular? Tell me, would you? Well, baby, I've been around the world But I ain't seen myself another girl Like you This ring here represents my heart there's just one thing I need from you Say I do Because I can see us holding hands Walking on the beach, our toes in the sand I can see us on the countryside Sitting on the grassland side by side You could be my baby Let me make you my lady Girl, you amaze me Ain't gotta do nothing crazy See, all I want you to do is be my love So don't give away My love So don't give away I thought I'd see my bestie <laughs> Yo, I couldn't even get a clip of me actually leaving the house Cause I was bawling my eyes out I was so sad, bro My heart was so heavy Literally This is just a reminder that If you live with your whole family in the same country You should be grateful Cause you don't know what God has done for you Look at my sister, bro. I can't believe I'm leaving her again. This was the moment where I decided that things are going to be different. I did not just travel thousands of miles by myself with a broken heart just to be the same when I get there. Things are going to be different. I am going to work on my goals. I am going to use my talent and I am going to work hard to make me and my family proud. Super proud. God is really good. You can't tell me that it's not good. You can't tell me. I'm Cause bro, I thought I was gonna be broken. I thought I was gonna be so hurt. Like literally, I know I was going to be. But I was talking to God. I was like, God, please, please do not let me fall into depression. Cause it is really that serious. Before I came back to Nigeria, I was bro, I was really, really, really in a dark place. I was mad, depressed. Ever since I came back, my niece and nephews were, they've been my joy, literally, my sister. And I longed to see them for so long. And now that I just saw them and I'm going back, usually I would just be like, bro, now what? After seeing them, so I'm going back. Like, I'm going to be sad, like, bro. No, but now I just have a different mindset. I just feel like at least you got the opportunity to see them. That is such a blessing, you know? So... I'm trying to keep the right mindset, you know? I'm trying to keep a positive mindset, y'all. I'm about to board for my second flight. Y'all, the food was actually mad good. I was shocked. Compared to the last time where I just ate Cheetos the whole time because the food was horrible. Tell me why you're crying, no kidding, big. 
Y'all, they actually had Burger King in Egypt. And I'm not gonna lie, the fries was not that good. I prefer American Burger King any day. <laughs> 